Hey everybody, this is Steve with FreeSky, and today we're going to talk about the proper orientation for calibration. Um, here we are, we have ourselves, everything should be at this level right here. Now, this is going to be fairly similar to what you have if you have probably most of our stabilized receivers. That includes things like the Archer SR10 Plus. And we're going to go through here, I'm going to show you how to do this. So. First thing it's showing is that it wants it to be pins up. So I just go into calibration, hit the enter button right here. Go into calibration, pins up, hit enter. Now, we're done with that. It wants pins down. This is pins down. Hit the enter button one more time. It said it did it right. Now it wants pins up. See so right there, pins up, pins are up right there. Here we go. Now it wants pins down. All right, here we go. This is what pins down looks like. This is what pins down looks like. Hit enter by hitting this enter button right there. All right, pins to the right. I know it's confusing, pins right. If you look, there's pins there. It's not those, it's these pins right here. And then what we have to do is, this is where people can often blow it. It's the writing has to be in the front. Right in the front, pins to the right. And that's hard to tell, but that's exactly what I have going on here. And I hit enter. Move back a little bit. Waiting. Now it pins to the left. So when you're done with the process and the TDS are 12, it should be sitting facing forward. And this one, I'm having a bit of an issue with it because um, the antennas want me to uh, pushing the whole unit forward. So what I do in situations like this where I'm fighting antennas is I have to sit there and play with it a little while until it comes out right. And I move it around. Now it should be good. And I hit enter. Press enter to start. Waiting. And calibration is finished. So we're done with the process. Hopefully it's that simple.